field effect transistors. Explained. Field effect transistors. Field effect transistors, or FETs, have become more important than bipolar transistors. They are easy to make and require less silicon. There are two major FET families, junction and metal oxide semiconductor. In both kinds, an output current is controlled by a small input voltage and practically no input current. Junction field effect transistors. The two main kinds of field effect transistors are N channel and P channel. The channel is like a silicon resistor that conducts current moving from the source to the drain. A voltage at the gate increases the channel resistance and reduces the drain source current. Therefore, the FIT can be used as an amplifier or a switch. Junction field effect transistors operation. This arrangement shows how an N channel field effect transistors works. A negative gate voltage creates two high resistance regions, the field, in the channel adjacent to the P-type silicon. More gate voltage will cause the fields to merge together and completely block the current. The gate channel resistance is very high. More about junction field effect transistors. Since they are voltage controlled, junction FETs, or JFETs, have important advantages over current controlled bipolar transistors. 1. The gate channel resistance of a JFET is very high, millions of ohms. Therefore the JFET has little or no effect on external components or circuits connected to its gate. 2. The very high gate channel resistance means practically no current flows in the gate circuit. Why is the resistance so high? The gate and channel form a diode. So long as the input signal reverse biases this diode, the gate has very high input resistance. 3. Like bipolar transistors, JFETs can be damaged or destroyed by excessive current or voltage. Kinds of junction field effect transistor Junction field effect transistors are used in many different applications. Since they cannot be used for high power roles, most are installed in small plastic or metal packages. Here are the main categories. Small signal and switching. Small signal junction field effect transistors are used at the input stage of amplifiers to provide a higher resistance input. They are also used as switches. High frequency. High frequency junction field effect transistors are used to amplify or produce high frequency signals. Junction field effect transistors symbols, gates internally connected. This is for the N channel. And this is for the P channel. Metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistor. The metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistor, or MOSFET, has become the most important transistor. Most microcomputer and memory integrated circuits are arrays of thousands of MOSFETs on a small silver silicon. Why? MOSFETs are easy to make, they can be very small, and some MOSFET circuits consume negligible power. New kinds of power MOSFETs are also very useful. MOSFET operation All MOSFETs are N-type, or P-type. Unlike the junction field effect transistor, the gate of a MOSFET has no electrical contact with the source and drain. A glass-like layer of silicon dioxide, an insulator, separates the gate's metal contact from the rest of the transistor. A positive gate voltage attracts electrons to the region below the gate. This creates a thin end time channel in the P-type silicon between the source and drain. Current can then flow through the channel. The gate voltage determines the resistance of the channel. More about MOSFETs. The input resistance of the MOSFET is the highest of any transistor. This and other factors give MOSFETs important advantages. 1. The gate channel resistance is almost infinite, typically 1 quadrillion ohms. This means the gate pulls no current from external circuits. Well, it may borrow a few trillionths of an ampere. 2. MOSFETs can function as a voltage-controlled variable resistors. The gate voltage controls channel resistance. 3. New kinds of MOSFETs can switch very high currents in a few billionths of a second. CAUTION! Because the glass-like silicon oxide layer below the gate is so thin, it can be pierced by too much voltage or even static electricity. 
Even the static charge generated by clothing or a cellophane wrapper can zap the gate of a MOSFET. Kinds of MOSFET Like junction field defect transistors, MOSFETs installed in small metal or plastic packages are used to give amplifiers an ultra-high input resistance. They are also used as voltage-controlled resistors and switches. The most important category has become Power Power MOSFETs allow a few volts to switch or amplify many amperes at very fast speeds. These are the most common MOSFET symbols. The N channel, and, B channel. How field effect transistors are used. Field effect transistor are used as amplifiers, switches, and voltage controlled resistors. Here are some typical circuit arrangements. A junction field effect transistor, electrometer. This ultra-simple circuit is the electronic version of the electroscope. The gate lead of an N-channel junction field defect transistor is left disconnected. Normally a current flows from source to drain. When a negatively charged object, like a plastic comb that's been stroked through your hair, is placed near the gate, the current flow is reduced or stop. A MOSFET lamp driver this circuit shows how a power MOSFET can be used to switch on a lamp or other DC powered device. Since the power MOSFET has an almost infinite input resistance, the switch can be replaced by a tiny input signal. A MOSFET lamp dimmer. This circuit uses a power MOSFET as a voltage controlled resistor. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, kindly leave a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, just click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for more videos.